All right, we have been waiting. Hero for year three, the Viking. All right, we can obviously see the swords in the background are spiking up every time the lightning strikes. She looks a whole lot like Shaman. She's got a war hammer. So is she like God of Lightning, like Thor? Oh, the dragon in the background? What's going on? Okay, it's obvious she's got some face painting and some piercings here and there, and that's it? That's all we get? Holda. Hold, she's got a war hammer. Obviously lightning in the background, so she must be like a goddess or something. Like, inspired by Thor or something. And then the dragon? What the hell was that about in the background? Alright, we gotta look at this one more time, guys, because this trailer just kind of went... It's only a 53-second trailer. Let's look at it one more time. Okay, so she's sitting up there... We have been. For years. Devoted our bodies to the great cause. Which, I mean, she's not lying. The Vikings have been kicking our asses for the whole entirety of the faction war. She does look a little more rural. She looks like Shaman. So the serpent in the background. Is that gonna... Okay, so that serpent is either gonna be her, like, pet that she has during her seasonal event... Or it's gonna be a game mechanic. She can call in a serpent to, like, attack the enemies or something. She's got a Warhammer, so obviously... It's cool that she's a female, though. Holda. Okay, um... I'll be right back with my final thoughts, guys. Hey guys, what's up? Shadow Ninja here. Welcome back to Rage Quit. I know I just did my reaction on the Year 3 new Viking Hero reveal trailer, and for the most part, it looks pretty okay. I mean, uh, it was a little vague. I mean, I know with Vortiger and Sakura, it was a little more, like, grounded, and we actually knew what the character was about, especially with Vortiger, because it gave, like, a whole cinematic thing. But with this character, Holda, I'm pretty sure that's not going to be her actual name. It's probably just the character name, but the actual uh, unit name is going to be something different. Holda! is obviously very shaman-like. You can see on her character, she's got the bone necklace. She's got fur around her. She has a war hammer. She's standing on top of a mountain, and every time the lightning strikes, like, swords appear around her. And when she lifts up her hammer, obviously you guys can see in the trailer, a serpent appears in the background emerging from the clouds. So what I was thinking, what I said in my reaction, was maybe she uses that in battle, either that or um, sh that's going to be like a seasonal pet, like a, a serpent that kind of slithers around her or something like that but it's obvious that she has like this godlike power because i mean she's got a war hammer and there's red lightning in the background and when she lifts it up that's when the serpent appears and i don't know guys i don't know what to think about this but i'm pretty excited for this viking hero as i said before in the sakura uh reveal trailer i'm going to be doing a rep 10 with every single viking part two so stay tuned for that and i'm going to be releasing the rep 10 with every woolen soon we only have one more character after this, guys. So we'll see what Sakura has, I mean, what uh, Holda has to offer. So, guys, if you like this reaction and this uh, little aftermath of what was going on, please consider to like this video and stay subscribed, as I already told you what's going to happen with these characters on the channel in the future. Going to be repping them out and showcasing you all the legendary gear that I put on them and their little cosmetics, as I have with all the other factions. All right, guys, as always, thank you for watching. I don't know what to make of this character right now. There's not a whole lot to go off of, and a couple things that just kind of spread out in the trailer, they really don't connect. They don't really make sense. I mean, I'm still excited for the character, but I wish we knew a little bit more about her. You see the character in the background narrating, but it's just normal Viking stuff. We've been waiting for years. Now we're coming out. We're going to mess shit up. But anyways, guys, with all that being said, thank you for watching. And as always, I'll see you on the next one.